I'm Justin Chang for the Los Angeles Times, and this week I'm reviewing Hereditary, a new domestic horror film starring Toni Collette. My name's Annie. My mom died a week ago. She was a very private woman, and she wasn't altogether there at the end. Hereditary is one of the most emotionally upsetting films I've seen in recent memory. Toni Collette gives a stunning performance as Annie, a gallery artist who makes intricate domestic dioramas, a sly metaphor for the unseen forces shaping her family's tragic destiny. As the movie begins, Annie is grieving the loss of her mother, who seems to have exerted some kind of sinister hold on the rest of the family, which includes Annie's husband, played by Gabriel Byrne, their teenage son, played by Alex Wolfe, and especially their young daughter, played by Millie Shapiro. What happens next in this story is so emotionally brutal and unsparing that to describe Hereditary as a horror movie almost feels inaccurate, or at least incomplete. This is a shattering portrait of a family in full meltdown. Make no mistake, it's also a brilliant exercise in paranormal and psychological terror, a masterful demonstration of how a filmmaker can build tension through meticulous framing, steadily roiling tension, and strategic use of darkness. The filmmaker in question is Ari Aster, making what may well be the debut feature of the year. Hereditary is not for the faint of heart, but it's superb cinema by any genre and any standard. I'm Justin Chang for the Los Angeles Times.